What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. Hopefully, if you're watching on Twitch, you guys will be able to uh, to see this. We are doing the Rylos 24 Opposite Stip. Can't draft the colors of the last deck you played on stream. Last night, the last deck we played was literally a mono blue deck for a different stipulation. So now, we are yeah, forced to play phone, so. everything but blue deck. Why you gotta interrupt me? <laughs> Can't you just wait like two seconds? I'm gonna take Mind Twist. Because that seems like the best non-blue card okay you good okay okay i mean it was working on my on my browser too but i mean i know that it's not the same for everybody so oh we get past mr confluence and fallen shinobi that's cool that's cool magic that's cool <laughs> all right i guess we take croxa we take croxa it's not maybe terrible. toxic deluge instead I thought he wasn't supposed to be on his phone today. I don't know. Is that a thing we did? I like Elspeth Conqueror's Death, too. That card's pretty good. What a blame. I think Basalt Models might be the best card in this pack, though. It's also pretty good with Mind Twist. It is not Wednesday, my dudes. <laughs> I don't even think it's close to Wednesday. I'm gonna take Overgrown Tomb because I feel like we're gonna be some sort of Abzan mix. <sighs> oh, Psalm Simulacrum. Let's do it. Let's do it. Savannah over in Catacomb, though. Oh, a tooth and nail, though. I like Vernon Catacomb. Maybe that Savannah comes back. Michael's texting his mom. I am not. Michael's texting his dad. Oh, I like That's a con. slightly closer to the truth. You're texting your dad is closer to the truth than texting your mom? I guess not really. I was like, what? I think it's Karn. I would love to take either one of these bad boys, but Karn too good. Hmm. Hmm. With a you live Vampiric Tutor is actually fine. Oh, what up, Tanos? Mike B, would you mind posting yourself on the Discord? I could do that. Oh my god. Jeez. And just like that, Michael B had so many friends. <laughs> I think it's Vampiric Tutor. I think it's better than Liliana. Oh, I like a Doretti Spaghetti. Oh, I like an Eternal Witness, too, especially if we're got them greens going. When the days are in Mike's putting the, his phone in the chat. Ooh, Gala Shrine came back. Also, Maelstrom Pulse. Maybe we're not white. Maybe we don't even care about white at all. Let's live in a world where we don't give a shit about white. Although, all if right. that Savannah comes back. The number is in the Discord. I'm going to be a lot more concerned with white. God, Michael B's just giving out his phone. I'm going to start writing your phone number on fucking bathroom walls. <laughs> Hey man, should I get this hoodie? Hold on, I'll open in a bigger thing. Uh oh, Elspeth Conqueror's Death came back. Oh, Sakura Tribal over there. Shit. Deluge. This pack is pretty good considering it's got six cards in it. Jeez. Cheddar. Gee. I think Elspeth Conqueror's Death is probably too good. Especially if we can get that Savannah back. Ain't no Savannah back. Hmm. I like Sword, man. Over Oblivion Ring? All right, I'll take Sword. Eh, Hero's good. Come on, Savannah. Guys, should I get this? Should I... Oh, God, you're not going to save it as a fucking image. Come on. Uh, 
Oh, Gideon? All right. Uh, actually, scavenging is better. A lot better. Should I get this Hannibal Burris hoodie that says whack on it? My problem is it's really low quality. <laughs> well, that is. That image is. The hoodie isn't. Right, but it's just going to be like a print screen, right? I mean, it's from Hannibal Burris. I don't know. Whatever he makes. Oh! That's a good one. <laughs> it was happening. I mean, the Savannah didn't come back, which is sad, but that is from the Eric Andre show. That's a long pant leg hoodie. Yeah, that's. <laughs> Shut up and take my money. Fancy art. Let's go, Knowles. Hey, man, this is a Washington Redskins hoodie, guys. Don't get it twisted, okay? Hunter, stop. He'll never do it. I'm take Sylvan Library. Seems like a good choice. This guy's got this guy's pack's got a lot of picks in it that are that are juice. Oh, Marsh Flats is nice. So is Signet. So is Moxie. Signet Picnic. I per, I like the Mox a lot. Signet Picnic. I like the Mox a lot. I'm gonna say Signet Picnic. Picnic. Pig. Pig. Today, Junior. I meant to say Picnic. 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 I have no idea. I still have no idea what you're gonna say. We don't have any duels yet, right? Yeah, we have Verdant and Overgrown. They're literally in, and they're right here. Yeah, we have no white, white boys yet. No, we have no white boys yet. <laughs> I like Diamond then. Thank mm. you. Roar! Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Although Signet, I do is like it. I actually, him seems good in our deck. I'm taking him. You don't think Mox Diamond's acceleration? Probably be at the pitch of land. That doesn't mean it's not acceleration. That's just the cost. I guess that's true. It literally is true. <laughs> I guess it's true. Well, yeah, but you have to get rid of a land. So, like, is where a signet, you don't have to get rid of a land. Uh huh. You, you have to pay I mean? mana for a signet. That's true. So, I guess it kind of evens out. It kind of evens out. Mox Diamond kind of evens out with Celestia's signet, guys. You heard it here first. I'm going to take Golos. Maybe. We're going to watch Ryan. No milk will ever be our milk. Uh, I'm gonna take coercive portal. Mm, yeah, there's nothing else. In the what are you gonna though. do about that? Nothing. I mean, I can't stop. You. Oh yeah, this is the this is the dude we want. This guy just wins games. He don't give an f about nothing. Kadama's reach maybe. Do you have a Karn? I mean, I'm trying to get seven man. Yeah, I mean we got Solemn, we got Basalt Monolith, we got Soul Ring. What do you want to take over it? I don't know. We also have Dryad. Anguish on making is pretty good. You can also good. get more fat boys and need more lands. <sighs> kind of like Languish. Languish kills our questing beast, though. Oh, I guess you can't play it ever, then. I'd actually rather take Anguish over Languish. Anguish over Languish. Wow. Why do you act like this? I mean, three life isn't nothing, though, but I think it doesn't matter too much in most matchups. Ooh, Temple oh, Guardian. Oh, that's good. Oh, Golgari's singing in duress, though. I'm still not convinced we need to be white here. Let's take yeah. the signet. I can see that. Oh, Vraska and Hero's Downfall? Oh, I like Vraska a lot here. Especially if we got like a bitter blossom in the future. Yeah, we're taking Vraska. <clears throat> Man. Plow under? Oh yeah, we're taking Plow under. This deck's looking spicy. Wow, these both came back? I don't think Tracker. This deck's looking juicy. Okay, sure. You got me. Bird alive. Sure. Ophiomancer with a Vraska? Oh yeah, sack a snake every turn. Give me one of them snakes. Just FYI, I finished Breaking Bad again, and I just started. I just started. So Camino for the first time. So Camino. I don't know what that means. 
El oh, we meant to say El Camino. God dang it. Uh. Is there an exception for power in this stipulation? Oh, I hope so. Dang it. I like trophy. I mean, I'll be blue anyway. So sad. And we can play it off of like one solemn simulacrum and one dryad. Yeah, there's a possibility we get duels. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to take it. I think it's for fellows. What? Are you confused? Oh, yeah, we're only two colors. I thought we were yeah, two. like, we're going to have a good amount of forests, my dude. Look, we could just take an underground sea. <sighs> oh, where's the justice? I think Avenger is good. We don't have a lot of top end right now. I mean, I like power too, but the sip does say don't play the colors you were playing. That's so. why I didn't take it. It's not in my pack, Michael. Take it by you. Look at this. Beautiful. Beautiful. We don't actually have any double black cards except for him to Torak. Why, Sammy? Because we're doing a stipulation. Oh, Bitter Blossom. Oh, I like a Bitter Blossom. Especially with a Varaska. It's also good with Sword. Oh, it is good with Sword. Yeah, alright. I, I hope this Garrett comes back, which seems very, very likely. Warm Coil seems good. I like big worms. And I cannot lie. All you other brothers can't deny that when Mike B walks in with a big old worm and a there's a hoofy boy, but I don't think we're aggressive I don't think we're for that. I think it's probably just blooming marsh. Unexciting, but probably the correct pick. Nothing that great. In the, I yeah. guess the sword, but huh. wow, I'm taking this. No respect that. People don't respect. Actually, maybe it's finale. I feel like you can splash Stone Forge pretty easily, though. Off what? Didn't you? No, you didn't take. We have not. We have no white sources whatsoever, except for Solemn Simulacrum. This this card's just fine. What a tale you live. You know that song? I hate Necroton. Oh, Assassin's Trophy came back. Yeah, I'll take an Assassin's Trophy. Oh, Ultimate Price came back too. That's nice. Now we're getting a little... I'll put ooze in the sideboard. Maybe. Maybe it's just main deckable. Something's gotta get cut. Something's gotta get cut. Do, 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 do. It's a good song. <coughs> there ain't no next pack. This is pack three. J chart. It was your monocolor deck that we did last night. The mono blue deck that uh, that forced us to pass that time walk. Just so you know, buddy. It's all your fault. Oh, another sword. Interesting. All right. Interesting. Son of a biscuit box. You can have all the swords. Take Darky Boy. Take Ellie Speth. Take Condemny Boy. No respect. That's ridiculous. That's actually ridiculous. I don't think we want both swords, man. I think this one might be better than the main. Really? You don't think pro black is better than pro blue? It depends. Also, I think if you connect with sword and body of mine, it's a bigger... <coughs> How much removal we got? A good amount. Tempted to cut trophy. Why wouldn't you cut price first? Because I think price is better than trophy. I don't want to give them a random land most of the time. It kills anything though. 
It's a cool story, bro. Tell me more. Tell me another. Really always do it. Tell me another story, Dad. Price can be bad sometimes. Trophies generally always good. Think we play Bob? I don't know, man. We got a six drop, seven drop, seven drop, five drop, four drop, four drop, four drop. I also don't want to. We also have to make cuts rather than. Rather than start adding cards, so. Uh -huh. I wonder if Avenger is any good here. I mean, it's basically untap you win, right? Let's take these out. Take all the price out. <sighs> Empire Tutor's fine, I guess. It's still unexciting, but. Yeah, but being able to get a mind twist or like a car in a certain spot seems good. Come and knock on our door. Or like get a sword sometimes. Michael B. lives in the zoo. It's Michael B. too. It's a Three's Company theme song, guys. Okay, maybe. I want to attack with my gentleman in the air. <clears throat> Just play both swords and play 42. What are you saying to me? Both swords? Mm -hmm. El Camino is fantastic. I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. All right. That'll do. Yeah, it means it's like dark. Is it really? I mean, like, did you watch Breaking Bad? <laughs> That's, like, I feel like Breaking Bad is pretty, pretty dark. Katie, hi to you. Katie is walking home from her run, and she's listening to the stream. Oh, what up, the decider? <laughs> oh, boy. I'll say you too. That seems nice, right? Come on, give me a land here. Soul Ring. Land. Maelstrom Pulse? Okay. That's close to land, I guess. It's not. We're still playing white. What commander deck would you want to play? A Jace team deck, a Lilana team deck, or a Nicol Bolas? Obviously, Nicol Bolas. I don't even think that's close. What did you say to me? What did you just say? It's too bad they're playing white. Why? Because Warm Boy might get pathed or swords. <laughs> Not on my watch. How are you going to stop him? I'll use my brain power. <laughs> me use big brain. You know what I'm going to have for dinner, Michael? What? Chicken McNugs. Really? I don't know. Maybe. You feeling the nugs? I've been feeling for a while. Maybe it's just time to pull the trigger. Where from? I said McNugs. Okay. Is that did, ha, what name another restaurant that offers a McNug? Man, I call them McNugs everywhere. Well, that's your fault, not not anyone else's, really. So, smokestack. Fascinating. Yeah, the other upside to McNugs. Yes, they Mike. cheap. They are cheap, just like your mother. Uh, your cheap mother, Michael. Oh, Katie's not listening. It won't load. That's really sad. Apparently the... Uh, oh, well, see, here we go. Oh, I thought they were going to do it. I got real scared. Look at that. I used an Assassin's Trophy on a maze of it. What sauce do you like? Honey mustard or barbecue? Barbecue is top tier. I think those are the two best. Not a big fan of this smokestack, I'll be honest with you. No, sir, I don't like it. You can probably get rid of Monolith, though. You think so, Michael? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Do you think I can get rid of Monolith, Michael? You sun tap, sack your Monolith. Oh. Fascinating. This seems worse for you. 
Yeah, he's really relying heavily <laughs> on that smokestack. Huh. <clears throat> Two and Sarah's Dece. Shut up and take my money. Oh, okay. Here you go. Can't wait to see the set. Oh, 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 yes. Mike, thank you so much for the donation, buddy. Really appreciate it. Awesome. Mike uh, messaged me on Discord, and he was like, what do you think about this? And I was like, all right. We can only take one card per set. Oh, interesting. I don't know if that's easy or hard. Uh, I think it's, it's hard to keep track. But it's easy in terms of, like, the number of options there are. No, that's not. Nope, that didn't do it either. Let's go here. Okay. I hate that programs don't just use plain text. Right, I'm like, I have to have, like... I, I, never, I, I never want it. I, like, copy and paste something, and then it's, like, it's, like, it's got all the formatting from where I copied it from. So, so I like, it, yeah. I'll toss it in, like, a search a search box and then copy it from there. And I'm like, well, this is not... I do that all day at work. It's real annoying. It's so obnoxious. I'll sack these two. So now they have to sack two perms out of there. Oh, what did I do? Mistakes were made. Oh, oh no. Actually, no, that's better because this is going to go up to three. So we would have had to sack this if we actually played it. So it's, it's kind of better that we didn't, I guess. Well, you still wanted to do... Never mind. What? I mean, they could just keep it on two, but that seems bad because then they're just going to sack their board and we're not going to lose anything, so. <clears throat> also, Bitter Blossom's a pretty good follow-up. Eventually, yeah. One, yeah. How do they plan to keep up with their smokestack? I don't understand why people play smokestack in decks that it doesn't belong in. I don't understand smokestack as a card. I'm like just if, like... Like, in our deck, it might be good because, like, you can play Bitter Blossom, right? And then you just keep it on one and you just always sack your But they're going to have no... They're going to have no permanence and we're going we're gonna to have seven cards. There's three cards. Right. No, it's bad. Why are they still playing things? All right. Well, we're going to sack these. I don't understand what's happening, though. Like... Okay. All you, dude. So they sack a vampire and legions landing, I guess. But like they have one card, so like they're sacking more cards than they're drawing every turn. Also, we're at thirty-two. Yeah, this is strange. Get rid of plow under. It's a little too, a little too big brain. Too thick. It is too thick. <clears throat> okay, now he sacks smokestack and the top. Interesting. But they only have one card in hand and they're really not threatening us. Right, so now we just gotta start playing land soaring, soaring, soaring. Dang it. It's still fine. That's really pretty good. So you have two cards and one Dang creature. You. Uh, this seems terrible. God of Flesh, thank you so much for the gifted sub, buddy. Really appreciate it, my dude. Let's just get like a Hero of Blade Hold hold in play, it'd be good, but they don't. <laughs> Last two cards, Elspeth Ancient Tomb. They're like, oh, I can get these down. Well, now you have no cards and one vampire, so. Well, my mean my middle our hand is pretty stacked, so. Um, let's play library here actually maybe library seems better because we have a lot of life to work with so we can guarantee us hitting a land drop next turn to solemn simulacrum that's for true that is for true man mind twist seems pretty bad when they have no no cards in hand yeah but when mind twist is bad generally you're doing pretty good I guess that's true actually that's a, that's a fair point oh look at this guy He's real aggressive. Okay. What do we got here? Oof. Brown. Oof. I'll pay four for one of these bad boys. Because we're going to shuffle anyway, so put on top. 
Okay, four. And give me another force. Come and knock on Mike's door. He lives in the trash can. Hey, look, they got three creatures. Did they not level up? Oh, they did okay. Well, they did it once. Yeah, they're probably going to do it again after this. No, I thought they forgot to put it to the level where it had first strike. Put it to the level. So we're going to have six mana, huh? Oh. Oh, Vareska seems so it is a uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana. So you can actually Vraska Maelstrom Pulse and just put them, leave them with like nothing. Seems decent. That seems pretty good, yeah. I would just pay. Well, I'm putting this on top. Oh, I'm yeah, sure you definitely paying that. four. Also, Bitter Blossom plus Vraska. Combo! It's definitely not bad. Kill this. Um, I mean, they're just going to bounce him if we, if we do it. So I'll just kill you. It's not the best use of Maelstrom Pulse, but... I mean, they're going to attack and we're just going to block, and that's totally fine. Your dog stole someone's shrimp chips. Hmm. Mine did? Brutal. Oh, man, yeah, he's, he's indestructible, all right. I'll draw a card. Okay, so this game is basically over, right? Like, we all agree. So this game is basically over, right? We all agree. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Um, put on top. Go to 13. Yep, all right. Sweet smokestack. <laughs> That's just a waste of time, man. Like... Also, our price seems good against the mono white. I got some creatures deck. You right, buddy? I know. Dang. Why are you so offended? Because I just felt attacked. Okay. How was that attacking you? Listen, I'm a liberal snowflake, Michael. <laughs> Everything offends me. Clearly. Let's get rid of salt models. Maybe I don't know. Did did turn this bad boy out? Ah, <sighs> tireless tracker maybe. Okay. Mono white. I got some creatures. Yeah. Yeah, Smokestack is just a terrible card. I just don't know who it's fun for. I'm like, is this fun for you? No? Because it's not fun for me. So, who? <clears throat> okay. This seems good. Two removal and two card advantage. Three lands. Oh, yay. Also, three removal. I don't know if you know that, but Vranska is able to remove things. My, oh, yeah. Did you just forget that mode? I may have. Wow. How did you think we got rid of one, like, their student aura literally like two minutes ago? Katie, my love, how are you? How did you think that happened, Michael? You don't need it. You, you got enough removal. Michael, you, cards. you need to get your head out of the garbage can every once in a while. It's hard. That's what she said. Michael Scott. I don't know. It was fun to watch. Yeah, that's why they made magic cards back in the day, because they were fun to watch. <laughs> What's this going to be? Oh, a Brightling. Oh, wow. Look at this dude's going. All right, so you have again, you have no cards in hand. This is wild. 
I guess they can protect their Brightling, but... Well, I'm going to force them to do that, and then we're going to Maelstrom Pulse it, so... Because now they don't get to land, even. I'm so, I'm so good at this game. <clears throat> See you later. Bye. Enjoy your one two. Oh, they're gonna sack their. Are they gonna sack their Lotus to save it? Oh wow, no. Okay. How would they save it? They use one of the abilities that are printed on the card. Oh, they return it to their hand. Gotcha. Katie just walked slash ran like 2.7 miles, so. It's a good amount. Yeah. She's a little little run walker. Just like Michael. Except for Michael rolls his ankle. <laughs> like, <laughs> Except Michael ate shit. <laughs> oh, 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 Temple Garden. That's good. That's a good draw. Oh, no attack, huh? This is weird because you can't protect itself. She knows, also, know Dr. Footman. Yeah, Dr. Uh, Footman. I was texting him. Right. And he said, like, it's probably going to hurt for, like, two weeks. So. Does it still hurt? What's your, what's your pain level today? Probably the same as yesterday, so, like, four-ish. He, so, he sent me a pic of some exercises I can do once I start feeling a little better, though, to help heal it. Do Vraskin kill this? It feels correct, right? You want to do a 5k? Whoa. Dude, running is so hard for me too. It's very, very, I can like, I can walk for a while, but once I start running, I'm like, <laughs> it's a much different, it's much different. And I feel like it was something I could never get used to no matter how long I, I'm going to just course of portal here. Yeah, but you ever actually try to invest in like running? Yes. I mean, I tried to do couch to 5k for like two weeks Oh. and I just couldn't get it. Like, it's like now today you'll walk, you'll run for three minutes, walk for four minutes and then run for three minutes and do that twice. And I'm like, okay. Three minutes is a pretty good amount of running that's what i mean like it was really hard and like how my body wasn't into, catching how many up days into it was it for three minutes i don't know it, it, it ramps up pretty quickly though hmm. okay a sword sure that's pretty good well i'm definitely killing that sword well thankfully this is one like one of the most least oppressive swords i think i cracked that lotus just play brightling right now because that'd be pretty funny no. Are they keeping the, what are they keeping this Lotus for when they have five men on board? Uh, I'm going to say Carnage. Let's blow up all your things on the board right now. We have nothing. Running is bad on your joints. Grew up swimming. Swimming is where it's at. Very low impact. Katie, I sent you a hoodie I'm going to buy. Or I'm thinking of buying. I feel I like know, I there's a lot of benefits from running. I, I feel like getting rid of the sword is probably better. Because next time they just equip this to something else, like pearl black is really hard for us. <laughs> I mean, you are gonna lose your brass. I know. <sighs> but like, what's the alternative? The alternative, I guess, is killing the sword with assassin's trophy next turn. Ooh, I like that. Oh, we can't kill this anyway. We don't have a choice. Right. Actually, that's a good point. We could plus for Asuka and sack a land. I don't really like that either, though. I'm going to get that worm boy out. Oh, also, we can just return, return, return all witness it. Okay, you did your dance for 10 years. Prove it by doing flips. P.S. Oh, hold on one second. Um, <clears throat> okay, so I guess we're done here. Tooting means fart. When you are learning to break dance, you do toot quite a bit. Turns out the break dance battles have a lot of toot. Is that true? They just fart a lot? Because that's pretty funny. <laughs> Actually, if they do want to kill our Vraska, they have to um, put down the shields of their, their giver of runes. I didn't play a land. You're right. Wow. Oops. I'm, God. Well, because in my head I was like, okay, next turn we can turn a witness assassin's trophy, so we'll have five next turn. Dang it. That's pretty bad. Now we can't wormy boy. <sighs> Buttery biscuits. 
My joints are already wrecked. I did gymnastics for 10 years. <laughs> Might as well keep running. Katie, please don't don't push yourself to the point where I'll need to put you in a wheelchair one day. I'm going to say carnage again. I told her she has to do flips to prove the gymnastics. Wow. That's wild. You're wild. You're a crazy man. I just want to see people do flips because it's cool. Wow. That's crazy. Do, 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 do. You can just bounce this too. This thing is hard to deal with. You think they'll remember this time? They can't actually kill this without trading with it, though. I guess they could attack, give it plus one, negative one, and then give it pro green. You're 17, though. You can take a hit. Yeah, for sure. I'm just trying to figure out, like. Oh, this guy lets us play an land, too. Yes. Oh, that's gravy. He can make up for your mistake. <laughs> Shut the hell up. God. I think I'm going to give Raska back. Yeah, you don't get to crack your fetch. What a value. I know. I'm living the dream, man. I think Braska's real good. It kills everything in their deck, so. One, two, three, four, five. Until they go untap Elspeth for six. I mean, they've had six mana for a while, so. Katie, do you approve of my hoodie choice? <clears throat> right, that's why they're top decking it, Michael. They also get three peaks. But I feel like they've been peeking every turn. It's not peeking. It's rude. Here's the story of no, Michael B. Here comes Elspeth. She's gonna slip them on. Thank you. And then I wish. Yep, they need that six mana. And oh, well, actually, it's gonna be five because they use the top check two. Thanks so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Katie, you said no, you don't approve. Oh dang. That's really set. What is this bullshit, man? I have course of portal and I can play two lands a turn. What? I feel like these choices are so weird, dude. Now your brightling just can't get through. You only wear a goddamn navy blue sweater. How dare you insult me? My what? Oh my god. It's a black hoodie though. I don't understand. Why are you getting so mad? Good. Let the hate flow through. Jesus. You. See, man, you wanted me to play an extra land. I would have had one less land <laughs> if I played my land for the turn. Uh, okay, so... Clearly you have the foresight of a god, and I was incorrect. So do we just block and be like, use uh -huh. your lotus? No, because I think this is though, better yeah. than, than... I think we just take a hit, yeah. Like... Yeah. What, are they going to pump it? I don't know. Homage this time. That's a good boy. <laughs> that is a good boy. Want to trade, bro? Oh, you don't? Okay. That's cool. Uh, as a person who has played a lot of Armageddon's, that is questionable. I agree. Especially now because they can't even activate their top. Unless they sack their Lotus. <laughs> I guess if you want to do that. Bad. Yeah, we're just taking another three here. Sure, my dude. I mean, next turn, like if we draw like land, 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 like it's not even close. Okay. Homage. Homage. <clears throat> Homage. <sighs> One land, really? Whatever, I got a snake. What are you gonna do? Nothing. I 
I feel like they just cast Iron Man. It's like, me opponent have a lot land. Me cast Armageddon. <laughs> They're like, I have these cool cards like Smokestack and Armageddon in hand. I'll just play these. But why are you playing it right now? Because it's in my hand. Oh, well, all right. Oh, they didn't attack anymore. Apparently, Brightling is just... Uh, not good enough when you got one snake. Um, I don't think we have any good attacks here. I'll play this thing. The power is yours. Well, Lotus time, boys. When did they do this? Well, and they're topping? So did they not have anything? They're just like, I need, I need the mana now. Are they just hoping the top three cards are decked? That's what there? I'm wondering. Get one of them with top. <laughs> okay, they did not get there. Oh dear Jesus, baby Jesus! That was a poorly navigated game. That was something right there. Do 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 do. Our deck is good though. They probably can't lose. I'm gonna be honest with you. Our opponent makes terrible plays. We basically can't lose. <laughs> I'll see pro what problem is. The sand seems great. I agree with you. Wish you were on the play. We can do library into basalt into mind twist them, twist them and wrist them. That's what I always say. Is Frank also Parker Lewis? Yeah. God, wow, that's an old ass meme, dude. Wow, Parker Lewis can't lose. That's wild. I'm gonna blow my nose though, cause I'm feeling a boogie resurgence. So I am gonna. Is this two tissues or one? Fuck. Don't you be sneaking together tissues? Oh, I think it was just one. God, the plies are so thick that I can't even tell. All right, hold on. God, I feel like I couldn't get it, man. Soaring. Is I'm gonna do one too. Yeah, I'll do period two, man. Like we both did periods. <laughs> like, like, dude, this is so funny. I'm like, I just want to see if my cloud is still online. Katie was like, Katie was talking about the sweater, and she's like, "Is it a meme? I don't get it." And I'm like, "It's the comedian Hannibal Burris saying whack on the Eric Andre show. It's a meme, yeah." And she was like, I don't know any of those names or that meme. And I was like, oh, dang. Eric Andre is a treasure. Hell, Burris is a bigger treasure. Why are you that's booing me? I'm, I'm right. That's actually what I meant to say. I just said Eric Andre because of the show. Wow, okay. Not that Eric Andre isn't a treasure. Why are you booing me? I'm right. Whack. <laughs> there you go chat this is for you guys are we taking seven library here 
I was like, don't you give me a soul ring now. It's too late. You've already... Why would you not want to draw a soul ring? I still wanted it. I just want to draw a soul ring every turn in every magic game of all time. I still wanted it. I was very bitter. Because then you just go soul ring library. And what problem is? Hell rider, huh? It's a hell rider. Well, at least he doesn't have any friends yet. Nailed it. I told you we were going to draw Sol Ring. I didn't tell you that, actually. Wow, this is actually... These are not good to have. So we got four mana. And this guy costs four, huh? That's pretty rough. I guess we could just twist him. All right. Let's twist. We could have also considered monolithic in there, so next turn we could worm. I'll just model. I'll just worm anyway. I don't care. Guess we're taking. Well, no cards in hand. I don't really care about no grim monolith. Right, but I do care about the seven damage on board. That's what worm boys for. I mean, we'll be dead by then. Not if we draw land. We went. Oh, you're right. Yeah, you know what? That'll do. <clears throat> we do have to take two, so there's like some way we could probably die, but not with zero cards in their hand. Do Let's have, worm like, an again. Effect, and they don't really have like it in those we colors. did last summer. Katie, how do you feel about me getting some nugs for dinner? Some chicken McNugs. And some French fries? Oh, baby. Yeah, this is fine. I'm going to Vraska that thing to keep your. To keep your options limited, my dude. There's a lot of high, uh... Okay. I'm just gonna keep taking the lands. And then next turn we can take Avenger. Avenger. No, God, you so... It's like you knew. I got a pizza and extra fries. Chitty, chitty, bang, bang. See, now we attack because they can only get in with Hellrider because now I'll just block the Mishra's Factory, so. I feel like we're doing pretty good here. I'm no expert about Magic the Gathering, but. Also, even if you didn't block, you'd only really be taking one. Why would you say something so controversial yet so brave? <laughs> <laughs> or you'd be gaining one, is what I meant. Gaining one? Wait, no, you'd be losing one. Do you think when creatures attack you, you gain life? <laughs> That's wild, dude. Depends on the situation. I think Katie left. She's out. She was like, I don't need this anymore. I don't need this this negativity in my life anymore. I don't need this whack negativity in my life. She didn't like your whack meme. She, she didn't. Like she was like, suggestion. I'm offended by Hannibal Burris and Eric Andre, whoever they may be. Bird up. Oh, they're going face, not Vraska? That's interesting. I'll block. I wonder if they thought they could redirect the one to this. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's fine. Because I have no idea why they would attack otherwise, just, other than to just deal like one. If there's a land here, we're definitely going Avenger land. Hmm. I kind of just want to plow under maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six. Snake is good too, though, because then we can sack the snake token to the Vraska. You don't think we need cards to win? I think we just put them behind. They just can't come back. This guy could flip, though, and then they kill our Ophiomancer. Oh, I think we're just playing... <coughs> I'm just playing Avenger, actually, and then sacking a token to Baraska. That's also good. You're going to draw a step. I know, but it's not up to me, so... Oh. Well, I thought it was. Well, take, take a look at your surroundings, muchacho. Well, if you're getting nugs... There's only one option for me. To also get nugs? Oh, or to get little Caesars? Oh, yeah. Oh, my fucking God. What's your deal, dude? How do you live with yourself? Like, nugs are any better. I don't eat nugs three times a week. That's the difference. It's true. I know it is. That's why I said it. 
If they double, yeah, that's fine. You can double block here for sure. I'll kill a hunt master for a dryad. There's no way they're ever keeping up with the worm coil. Oh, I know. Little Caesars is delicious, and we actually both enjoy it pretty much. Pretty, also, Katie as well. Like we all enjoy it a good deal. I don't like their regular pizza, but their deep dish. The deep dish and the thin crust are both like head and shoulders above their regular like five dollars cheese. Yeah, their regular pizza is kind of trash. Puppy dog guys, you'll be all right. You'll you'll make it through people liking pizza that that is not uh, Michelin star quality. You'll be all right. Also, again, I'm pretty. Sh I wouldn't doubt that you've never actually had their deep dish or their thin crust. Yeah, the deep dish is actually just good. I won't. Oh wow, this is wild. Is this? Are they all going face? Because that seems only three times per week. Those are rookie numbers. Got to pump those up. What could they have drawn here? I also had nugs for lunch. What kind of nugs? Wendy's spicy nugs. They got rid of the deal though. Yeah, I'd just take the rest. Yeah, I think taking four is fine because I really don't feel like they're gonna kill us from this. I'm trying to figure out what they could have here. Wildfire? Okay. <laughs> Interesting, interesting. I'm only biased because every time I've had it, it gave me hot snakes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's... <laughs> I guess that's a fair reason. That's rough. What is that? Is that like a piece of lasagna? I don't know. What is this? Howie's got rid of their deep dish, so... You know, yeah. How how he's no longer has the Detroit style, which was actually the, our favorite thing there. Um, okay, so what do they have? Well, they're what like red green. Okay, so it's just as good for this. Um, I kind of like Necrotal here. Are Chick Fil A nuggets real nuggets? Do you mean like if they're made with real chicken? Chick Fil A are like the best, the the realest nuggets that you can get. Yeah, they're just white meat. I'll take ultimate price too, actually. They, they come with a side of hatred, but they are very good. Yeah, that's why I don't get them anymore. But I can't lie. Their nuggets do be good. Wait, is Hungry Howie's from Detroit and they got rid of Detroit style? That'd be hilarious. Yeah. That's like sacrilege. I know the meat is real, but like they are made with peanut oil and stuff. They aren't similar to any other fast food nugs. Oh, they, yeah, they're definitely unique. Good food, even better discrimination. <laughs> Jesus. Where's the lie? Turn two bitter blossom, man. Turn three basalt model. Turn four more crawl. Sounds what good. What a blank email. See, there's blank email again, man. Sneaking in. Warm if coil? I told someone to bring me nugs and they brought me Chick Fil A, I would be like, "This isn't what I asked for." What do you mean? Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Or do you mean you prefer like the processed kind of nugs? Yeah, I mean, as far as nugs go, like Chick Fil A is like the best nugs. I mean, just because they're not processed. I mean. I don't consider a nug processed. I just think most nugs are processed. But that's not like that's not like the bar I set for nugs where I'm like, if it's not processed, it's not a nug. Do you ever get the feeling that the waffle fries aren't like cooked all the way? Like every time I have Chick-fil-A waffle fries, I'm always like, I feel like they're a little undercooked. Is that just me? No, it's weird. You'll get like half of them undercooked and half of them are burnt to shreds. Yeah, it's really weird. Like I'll eat it and I'm like, this is chewy, it's like a chewy potato. That I'm not like, eh, it's not cooked all the way. You definitely get some that I'm like, I'm not sure, man. This might be a raw potato. No, I'm not a big strip fan because they always have the tendon, gross tendon strip in the in the meat. And I'm just not a fan of it. So, I, I like nugs to, to chicken strips for that reason. 
Mine are always perfect. Wow, always unbelievable. <clears throat> I think this? it also depends on the chicken strip and the nug. Like, we're talking Publix chicken strips? Oh, baby. Oh, they're just getting in there with Raging Ravine? Yeah, I'll block. I mean, we're already taking one a turn. I don't need to take four just to keep one fairy alive, so. Five Guys fries are very good. Honestly, I'm a big McDonald's fry fan. Like, I just think they do fries right. They're pretty good. This is only a ramp for one, man. That's wild. So that means one, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, real chicken has tendons, nugs, you just can't tell. No, they usually... no, that's not true. The cuts of meat they use don't have tendons in them. Like, it's just, that's just how it works. I mean, I'm talking about like Chick-fil-A nuggets, right? Like, those are cuts of white meat that don't have tendons in them. Yeah, in and out fries are, are not great. Yeah, their burgers are amazing, but their fries are garbage. <laughs> I don't hate them, but like... No, they're, they're, they're definitely they don't not. even taste like potatoes. They're like some weird... Potatoes. <laughs> they don't even taste like potatoes. Didn't mean to pronounce it that way, but I did. <laughs> oh. I don't know what. They just taste like weird. I, I can't explain it. I had Chick-fil-A nuggets and fries 26 times in three months. Always perfect. You could say I have a problem, though. I might. That's almost as many days are in the month. Right, but it's over three months. Oh. Three months. So that's like once every three days. That's still a lot. Correct. I don't know what's happening right now. Something big. Yeah. If we could just get in and out to get fries. One blight guys. steal. One blighty. I have no idea how to deal with that in our deck. Karn. Let's go, homage. Those guys are so salty. Well, if you don't like salt on your fries, I don't know what to tell you, man. Also, you can ask them to... They make them fresh, so you can literally just be like, hey, less salt or no salt, I'll add my own. Well. Karn, 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 Karn. Bill Nye, the science guy. Bill, 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 Bill. You know Bill Nye? You know science guy? Have you converted to fry sauce now that you're in Utah? No. Not a fan. I don't like fry. I don't think it's good. I think it's too tangy. I think it I'd rather have just ketchup or Same. just mayo. I would... They don't combine. At least the ratio they use or something is just off. I don't know. I don't like it. Give me my meat and build a dream on. We have another turn to draw Karn. What is fry sauce? It's basically just ketchup and mayo mixed. Uh, well, I think leaning more towards ketchup, and I think there's some seasonings in it. It's definitely not just ketchup and mayo, though. There's, a lot, there's something tangy in there. That's like the base, but yeah, there's definitely something else in it. Thank you. Oh, Zimini Pot, welcome back with the re Subaruski. Oh, look, Raging Green's coming out to play. Katie did an eye roll earlier. Katie, are you still here? What's even happening right now? <clears throat> Alright, I don't know what we can draw. I think we can draw, like, literally has to be Karn, or else we're dead to freaking Blightsteel Colossus, which is a fair and balanced magic card they will add pickle juice sometimes hmm Cajun or plain fries Cajun for me not close uh it's gonna go to the blocker step block block sometimes the Cajun is too much though it's like too, it's too spicy I love it but I can see that I love it are Jojo's a northwestern thing no I mean they have thick cut fries everywhere they don't call them Jojo's everywhere but oh good they have a removal spell Cool. Yep, would not have drawn it anyway. Okay, well, that's a thing we should be able to deal with, I guess. Maybe anguished on making. Yikes. It's funny because we have a lot of good white answers. Elspeth, Conquers Death, uh, Anguished on Making, and Condemn. I'll deal with the Phyrexian. Big boy. A Phyrexian big boy. Maybe if you want to side out a different color. Yeah, I think we're just fine, probably. Hey, man. 
Yeah, man. You ever figure out what that crazy plate of food was? The what? The crazy plate of food. Yes, it was leftover lasagna and crazy bread. From okay, her it was little... lasagna. Got it. It was lasagna. I'm so I'm a lasagna smarty pants. <laughs> Mike be the science guy. Mike, 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 Mike. He doesn't use the scientific method. No, don't go to the new one. Play the old one again. Whack. <laughs> Man, my opponent's really sideboarding. Yeah, now we just have to be more aggressive with our removal to keep them from getting to seven mana. Cause Mike be the science guy. He makes potato fries. <laughs> <laughs> he does not do that. He eats them, but he does not make them. <sighs> French fries are actually kind of complicated. Unless you do the frozen kind. But that's cheating. That's cheating. You got to fry them twice, boy. What? French fries are fried twice. What? I know you heard me, man. What? Uh, who's in our house? Uh, Jake, his wife Cassidy, me and Mike. <clears throat> oh, ten, 100 Frenchy fry bits. French, French fry bits. I got frosted said Frenchy fry. What's the hold up here? Are they just timing out? They're like, you know what? Chicken butt. Oh, yes. Is this a turn two worm coil? Turn three worm coil, I guess. Eh, it's not as good. Might as well concede. All right. Just kidding. <coughs> Mike be the Michael man. Yeah. How do we feel about Coria? Seems fine. Companions are a mistake. Otherwise, the set seems pretty fun. I heard the cycling deck in limited is annoying. Yeah, Luis posted it like a week and a half ago. Not like every pro on Twitter is posting about it. Yeah. Another weird Utah thing, dipping your pizza in a ranch dressing. That's not a weird Utah thing. Katie does that all the time too. Yeah, that's that's kind of everywhere. I think dipping your crust. Pretty sure that's an American thing. I think dipping your crust in ranch is okay, but the actual like main part of the pizza... Right, like I want, like I don't like the the marinara mixing with the with the crust with the the ranch. The ranch, right? Mm -hmm. I'm just like, no, nah, I'm not about that. It's so freaking good, though. Uh, I disagree. No. Especially because ranch is like a real hit or miss. Even if it was a good ranch, like those flavors just don't meld. Them. I agree with you. Soul ring, the science guy. Because I feel like the ranch just overpowers all the other flavors. Hey, thanks to ever gifting me a sub. Not very familiar with Twitch to know who to thank, but I'm enjoying it. Really good. Glad to hear it, James. Shut up and take Not all ranches are equal, 100%. I just want to say I really enjoyed the sip. You actually ended up playing a deck I would play even through the blind picks. Yeah, the deck actually turned out really well, dude. It's awesome, though. I mean, hey, man, if it's awesome for you, keep doing it. But I don't like it. I think it's gross. Yeah, I ain't going to stop you guys. The pizza and blue cheese, man, what a what a game changer. You can go to your subscriptions page to see there were some big, yeah, there's been some ridiculous gifts lately. I don't know what's going on. Okay, Chrome Mox into Firebolt into Land. Wall of Roots. Oh, cool. This guy. 
Hey guys. Okay. Cool. Well, that would be good. You wick back soul ring good? I mean, I guess we could do that, but I don't think we need to. <clears throat> it's not bad. I feel like if Fellows lives, we don't really need to do that. So a one. I think we're just getting another forest here. It's not oh, double yeah. black, but it does give us two mana instead of Oon. Dos instead of Oon. Nobody out pizzas the hut. You're delicious. That's from Spaceballs. You're from Spaceballs. Seriously? Yeah. It's awesome, dude. You are born on the set. On the set of the movie? Yeah. Wow. That's crazy. What does the guy in the back do exactly? I don't know. What, what do you mean? What does that, <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> okay, they're just going to kill all my things. That's... That's swell. If we get a land, that's actually pretty decent. We can go Eternal Witness, get back Soaring. Yeah, I know I know who you're referring to. I don't know what your question means. What I'm does actually he an do? AI program. I'm not real. <laughs> like, I'm like, no, dude, I get it. I understand the question. <laughs> Such a weird question when people ask that. What does he do? Uh, I I don't know what it, what has he done the entire time you're watching the stream, man. Like it's just a weird yeah, it's just a weird question. It's not a two player game. I don't know if that's what you're asking. <laughs> Sometimes I give him the controller and then he plays too. <laughs> I kind of want to kill this. Like it just puts him in top deck mode. Yeah, it's probably good. Thank you. Oh, I didn't think that was an office reference. I, I, I definitely didn't think that was. What exactly would you say you do here? I, I definitely did not put those two together. No, and then he followed up with another thing. So right. So I think yeah. it was just a general que general question, a genuine question rather. Then I'll bring the memes. That's fair. That is your right to do. Thanos brings the memes and the ruckus. So if we play sort of body, like they just don't. One, one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. They have nine mana. Could also, actually. you have back the Assassin's Trophy to get their monolith. Yeah. I mean, it only takes off two mana one time. I'm probably blocking here because we want to hit lands. Also, that's pretty much what that card was invented for, so. <laughs> Throw it in front of the bus. Okay, that's that's good. Okay, that's that's good. Say that's good again. No. Everyone take a shot every time he says that's good. No, don't take don't do it. Don't hurt yourself. You could just monolith overgrown too. This Mormon state. Did you guys hear about the protests in Madison, Wisconsin? No, I did not. Bill Nye, the science guy. Did you guys hear about Bill Nye, the science guy? Too late. I've already taken 10,000 shots. Jesus. Mother of God. So here's there's two lines you can take. We can go Monolith into Worm Coil next turn. Or we can go Eternal Witness, get back like soaring into I think we just want worm coil next turn because I think we want to save eternal witness to figure out like maybe we want an assassin's trophy maybe we want a soaring I don't know Like thousands of people gathered at the Capitol protest to stay, to stay at home order. Yeah, it's not very smart.
Yeah, just to be clear, I'm definitely not like two at a giant in one big shirt. That seems ridiculous. You got something else for this basalt model with a top deck? That'd be pretty impressive. Wow. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, at least that's gone now, so that's actually okay. Because now you don't have a way to deal with the sword. Actually, just gonna get Assassin's Trophy. I think the removal is a little better here. two-headed giant shirt stiff i'll find a giant shirt online i already mm -hmm. i literally responded to that and said i'm not doing that you gotta keep up you can't just be here for fucking five minutes after i respond to the things <laughs> hey man i was distracted How, what were you distracted by my phone oh well that makes it okay then hey man you missed chat a lot that's because i'm playing fucking magic the gathering on twitch.tv <laughs> I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I'm just like, you know, just reading the chat. Right, but you're literally... But I read it out loud, so it's like it's weird when you read the exact same thing I read out loud. That's weird to me. Cause, so much dude. Because I read it out loud already. Like, I said it in the world. Like, I read it out loud. No, I understand how reading works Did, when you read it out loud. Get out of here. Yeah, well, that's crazy, right? No, get out of here. But I just figured even if you didn't see it in the chat, you'd hear me say it out loud. That's my point. Well, it's hard to read and then hear someone talk and pay attention to both. Huh. Like when I'm reading something, if someone says something to me, it's I don't, don't really take in the information. How do you know if I'm talking to you or not? Wait, what do you mean? If I'm actually talking to you, and like if I'm trying to get your attention, I'm trying to ask you a question, I'm talking to you. How do you know if I'm doing that? Well, because in that case, you're probably like looking at me, and your voice is more like. Directed I rarely at me. look at you when I'm. I rarely do that when I'm when I'm when I'm streaming. I don't know, man. I just didn't hear you. Okay, okay. Well, this guy's gonna flip. So our wolf's probably gonna die anyway. So I guess we're taking two. Oh, we can actually just Worm Coil next turn. That's a pretty big game. Resume, I sit next to Frank Lepore and watch him play a video game. Because we're friends and I like doing it and it's fun and enjoyable and I interact with the chat. You can fuck off, buddy. Like, my, Would you like to know that I have a real day job? I do that. Like, this is for fun. If you don't like me, like, sorry, man. Most people do. You can go away. I don't actually know what this dude, like, I don't know what his, like, what, what the what the goal is here really it's really kind of weird i also don't know what resume in the beginning of your message means like is that some kind of clever bullshit i think it means <laughs> resume oh all right that's weird also that's a weird take because you're watching someone else play a video game right like internet. isn't that isn't that like so infinitely better than you who's just watching me play it on twitch <laughs> like Oh, uh, but my resume is better because I'm behind my computer screen and I get to watch you from the... I guess that's not better at all. I don't know. Oh, uh, I'm assuming they must have been gifted a sub and they're not a real sub. Oh, they are, yeah. yeah. Tonos gifted them a sub. Yeah. Yeah. 
I thought it was a funny question, but then he was, yeah, he was just serious. He was just being a douche. Like, that's literally the thing. Like, there's two people on a stream, and I don't understand it because I can't, I, things are confusing for me. So I, I really just want to, I want to insultingly ask questions uh, to clarify. So, you know, what are you going to do? I think I'm with the right to tell people to F off. I agree. I try to not do that often, but like when you keep hammering on the point and being a complete Yeah, asshole. like you've contributed nothing to the chat except for like... Like if it was just a general question, like why does right, he... Right, like... At hey, first it was fine. Hey, who's your I friend? Like, and then, it. I, then I explain yeah. it to you and you're like, oh, that's cool. Instead, you're like trying to like be shitty and condescending as a fucking nobody Twitch viewer. Like, that doesn't right. make any sense to me. Like, why do that? I don't understand your... What's your motive? What's your goal? You know? I woke up today and I was hoping to make a human being feel bad. That was what I wanted to do, because I feel better about myself when I do that. So I don't really get it, I guess. I would 100% hang out with you all day. God, okay, well, you guys probably want to take a break is the thing. Any thought on switching Sword of Oracle? Yeah, when I attack with it, for sure. I mean, that's an 8-8. Eight, eight. That's 8 life. Also, my uh, patience is short today because I'm a little tired. Well, also, like I, I like I like for my my stream to be incredibly welcoming, right? Like I I, I want to be incredibly inclusive. So, like if your literally only contribution to the stream or the chat or the channel is to like like not even like cleverly, but like kind of like pathetically condescend to someone, right. like like it's not even good points. Well, like you didn't bring up right. Even... It's not even funny. Like you're not funny or clever. It's just also, really dumb. You didn't give me any real criticism. Like you didn't be like, oh, I don't like you because X Y Z. He would just like. Trying to... You're existing differently right. than I expected you to exist in the world. Oh, good one. That's also, smart. And like anyone who regularly views the stream knows that like I contribute a ton. I don't know, man. Wow. <laughs> Got him. Are you talking about me? I didn't want to say anything, Sammy, but I can't stress enough my earlier point about all ranches not being equal. It's very true. <laughs> oh, it's very funny that you're like, you know, listen, guys, can we just go back to the ranches not being equal? We got two cards in hand. Also, like, no. Nah. Does this person not have friends? So you don't really understand how friends enjoy each other's company? Uh, That's yeah. It's like, well, I don't get it. I mean, definitely from what they've said, that would be my impression that they don't have friends. Right. Because like, I don't, I can't imagine the human being that wants to be like, no, it's like, no, man, this is your job. I can't be here. This is very serious. I got to let you do it. I can't be here. Expert, 12 out of three, 12 out and three draw. NH, I don't know what that means. Nice hand. Well, what do you want me to do, man? I got so in library. I mean, you literally like killed my soul ring and my Rafelos in like two turns. In the first two turns of the game. Like, what do you want, dude? Evidently, I gave you at least right, but that's but you can riff on things that aren't quality, right? Like it doesn't have to do with the quality of your content; it just has to do with like. I mean, I guess if your goal is a good reaction, congratulations. Then I guess you got me. You can write it down in your troll book. <laughs> That makes you feel better. Dear Troll Diary. Why do you keep saying basic math? I don't understand what's going on here. Basic math. Basic math. Basic math. Everyone's, dude, it's like a fucking troll day. I guess it's like, it is Trolls Day, my dude. Basic math. Wait, could you have alpha and kill them? Is that his point? But I don't think you could, right? No, I have two other. No, he's talking about like 12 out of 13 of my draws are very good. Oh, okay. Doesn't matter. I was really like, people get lucky in magic. I don't know. You can say it yourself, but like chatting about it is pretty BM. Oh god, hold on. Basic math is happening. I tried to text Mike, but my dinosaur fingers are too big. Hashtag basic math. Alright, well we're going to go around three now. <sighs> Mike, you're fine. I'm not trying to rip on you. Well then, what was your... I don't understand what you were talking about then.
Gas Chamber Hoax, if you're like seriously just trying to not, if you're not trying to be a dick, then that's totally cool. And I mean, if your text just came across weird, I'm sorry, but. Yeah, the, it's really hard to read on the internet, man. And like, on, I'll be honest on Twitch, like I get uh, preemptively defensive because I just don't trust where people coming are from. People are coming from a lot of times. So like. Fun fact, round three is after round two. Basic math. Dang. <laughs> We're learning a lot here today, guys. It's a lot of a lot of schooling. I wish I could do basic math. Well, too bad you're only just the guy that sits behind me, buddy. One day. Dang. See, now I'm just memeing on it. Because hopefully you are coming from a decent place and not being a dick. And that's totally cool if you are. Thank you. Oh. Oh, boy. This guy. I mean, at least we got answers. Have we ever? That. Oh, yeah. I guess we have trophy. I was gonna say, we hey, got we trophy mails from Paul's like, Frasca. We have lots of answers. Can, yeah. Overgrown tomb. Tanos, thank you for the gifted sub, buddy. I really appreciate you, bud. My man. Hey, my man. Basic math, bro. Also, how does this deck beat a fucking questing beast? Uh, it's got four toughness. You can't deal damage, right? No, that's not. <laughs> Mike just makes up whatever. <laughs> oh, it's combat damage. Okay, it's combat Mike's damage. Mike's like, I'm going to make up some abilities on this guy. Hold on. Oh, I see you don't trust random people in there. No wonder you didn't want to go to the most wonderful place in fly. That's true. That's true. That definitely contributed to it. Yeah, like, it's so weird to accuse people of, like, like to, to criticize people's draws on Magic Online. I'm like, do you think I did that? Or what do you, what do you, you stack the deck, bro? Do you think that was like a thing I did? So or? I was trying to ask a question because I didn't know at first. Then I tried to make a joke after. It didn't appear to come off well, but I tried to make jokes. You have to accept that sometimes they will fall flat. That's fine. Yeah, no worries, man. It's all good. Uh, wow. I'm actually... Wow. This turned out well. Also, like, to be fair, there's been trolls like that in the past who, like... But they ask it, like, in a shitty way. They're like, who's the guy behind you, like, just sitting there, like, you know, like, not doing anything? I'm like, oh, come on, don't be like that. Like... So, like, I get preemptively defensive about it same. because I've had to deal with it a bunch of times. Dude, Gas Chamber Hoax, man. We're good. It's all good. I'm glad we're good. I got real defensive, too, so hopefully, like... Because I just felt We've like dealt you were, with that problem so many times. Right, I get. I, yeah, well, I could, not only has it dealt, have I dealt with it, but I felt like you were. I felt like you just. What your your follow ups? I felt like you were just digging back in. So I was like, oh, he's just coming to, he's just coming to assault. So no, that's cool. I'm really glad to, that 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 it didn't actually uh, be the the way that we thought it was. Do you think they just kill this guy with uh, with their little fire spell? I think that's okay for us, right? Yeah, it's fine. Because it's kind of getting to the point where if they leave him three mana, it's getting kind of dangerous for us. They can't even block this guy. Hey, Tanos, good work on the gifted sub now, buddy. <laughs> Makes all... it, it checked out, so we're good. Stop stealing Mike's spotlight. Little Polsky. I'll never do that. I'm here for the dog. <laughs> Me too, buddy. If only we could have a hunter cam. See, he doesn't stand still. Yeah, that's a problem. He's always moving. And if you ever look at him, he starts moving. Yeah, because he's like, you gonna do, you, you gonna give me some attention? So if you look at him and he's not like just laying on the couch, he'll be like, all right, I'll come over there. Yeah, like I'll try to take pictures of him and he'll be like, oh. Yeah, but what about the ranch problem? Are you ranch? Are you for ranch or against it? Is Mike or Frank the contributor of the rat train? Uh, that is a Mike B special. What is this, Michael? What is this? <laughs> Can't hurt. Oh my god, dude. What? Oh boy. What are you doing, man? What's the downside? It's just, that's not a real thing, my dude. I didn't have to follow him. So if it doesn't happen, that just, that just I don't know, man. Like, I don't lose anything. I guess. It took me two seconds to reply. Plus, what if it's real and I just get 300 bucks? It's like entering a lottery, right? <laughs> yes, but it's like a fake Twitter lottery. Michael's given his, his cash app and Venmo information <laughs> to people on the internet. Is this too... What do we even... We've got five mana. Also, it was retweeted by someone I know, so I thought it might be legitimate. Was it a, was it a relative? No. It was a relative. 
It wasn't. None of my relatives are on Twitter except for my cousin. They have one land right now, so they can't even activate this, like, reasonably. <coughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. Ranch is amazing on everything but salad. Wait, what? You don't like ranch on salad, but you like it on everything else? That's where it goes. That's what it's invented for. I mean, I like it on other things, too. Don't get me wrong, but... Can we get a rat train or birthday emote at some point, Frank? What's a birthday emote? The rat train one sounds good. Yeah, that's for sure. We can do that. All right, so they're definitely equipping this guy with the sorty boardy. I think we you just... can trophy the shrine and then plow them. Yeah, that's not bad. Okie dokie. Well, we're definitely blocking that guy. We're talking about both, huh? Yeah, that's fine. We're just going to Avenger here. I feel like that's going to be pretty hard to beat. Avenger plus land? Oh, yeah, we're doing it. How good is the ranch from the rat train? Not great, to be honest. You gotta send them on down. Mike B, do you still have the gift of the rat train I sent you? I'm pretty sure. He doesn't. He doesn't keep anything you guys give him. Yeah, I delete text messages like that's a thing. <laughs> Who does go through their text message like, I'm gonna get rid of these? Don't they also like, go away naturally after a certain Maybe you space do. or whatever? I hope they don't crack if they don't crack the shrine here and we just get to Assassin's Trophy. Can you even delete text messages? No. Not by the, not 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 when the government has them. The government took my baby. You don't even have a baby, Michael. You don't know that. Do you have a baby? Oh, this baby. is this is perfect. Oh, wow, you're going to shoot this guy and you're going to two for one yourself just to kill this guy? Can you delete the government? Uh, somebody's working on that. Who? You know who. Edward Snowden? Yeah. God damn. Okay, so now we just get to Assassin's Trophy, the Shrine of Burning Rage, and that was probably their biggest win con. Mike had a baby. The government took it, see? Government took Mike's baby. <laughs> this is five, six, seven. We have eight. Then nine. We have 10. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Give me that. Let me get that mill. If it isn't old Smokey Loki, it's your boy. It's going to be game. Where the Michaels are? And we're going to Assassin's Trophy, which makes them shuffle those lands away. Three's company, two. That's, yep, that'll do. All right. Sorry, 10 damage ain't happening, my dude. It is 10's day, my dude. Scavenging you seems good. You get to eat their cards. Ultimate price is good. Necrotal is good. Karn is actually a little pricey. Have you tried Cube on Arena? They did have a version of Cube on Arena for a little bit. It was sealed, though, so I was just like, eh. I think Bitter Blossom can probably go. I don't want to take a million damage against a mono red deck. True. That's for true. Um, Tutor. Yep. Done. Oh, actually, Revoker seems decent. I don't hate it. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. We're also on a draw. You doing okay? Mm-hmm. She's having a little scratch. A little scratch. Pulse is a pretty good draw. Pulse is a pretty good draw. 
Pulse is a pretty good draw, Michael. Pulse is a pretty good draw. My name is Michael B. Soul Ring. Oh, hold my price. Actually, almost better. It's almost better. No, it doesn't kill that, right? Fuck! God dang it! Oh! <laughs> Why is it two colors? Why aren't you go for the throat? I feel like I get ultimate price way more than I go for the throat. Whatever, I'll still kill it next turn. Dang it. You can just block it, right? With what? With my snake? Yeah. What if they kill the snake? They ain't never gonna kill that snake. Okay, they might kill the snake. I'll They're risk it. Pretty reasonably. No, don't do it. I'll risk it. If they kill the snake, then it's not value, right? Like, they can kill the Ophiomancer. <clears throat> Follow the Michael. I guess the worst we got a ten, which isn't that bad. It's pretty bad. Okay, what are you gonna hit? What's it gonna be? Four drop, Daredevil. Dang it! You got it in the land. You do, but you can't cast anything. Look, Abbot of Crawl Keep drew them a card, and they played it this turn, Michael. Yeah, both of them suck. Do I just mind twist them for three here? Sol Ring? No, oh, dang it. That would have been real good. I kind of just want to kill this. I kind of just want to mind twist them. I think we're mind twisting them here. Yeah, I feel like if you don't do it now, it's going to get... Yeah, destroyed. they don't have great blocks, and or they don't have great attacks here. And Sulfuric Vortex oh. and Lightning Bolt? They didn't just slam the Vortex? That's weird. They would have been super dead. Come in, Michael, my bee. That sounds completely different than what you think <laughs> it sounds like. Sorry for being a newbie here, but anyone tell me how I can donate for Stips or just in general? Oh, I can tell you. Because that benefits me and my, my, my choice of living. My choice of living. Unforgiven. Also, don't worry about being a noob. Like, we are, we are all noobs. At one point. If you guys also don't even come and knock on Mike's door, then like what's the what's the point, you know? I'm just block. What's the downside? Well, if they kill this and then we can't make another snake, then it's like QQ, but then they have one card in hand, so like it's gotta be here. They didn't have it, so we just get another snake for free. I think I just want to kill this because if they draw another land, they would just attack for eight. Yeah, that seems a little dangerous. Dangerous. Like Darkwing Duck, you know? Let's get dangerous. Remember that? No. No, it's too bad. What's a 12-hour drive? What did I say? You don't remember Darkwing Duck? Huh? What? I am actually not wearing long sleeve pants right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, to come and knock on your door? Thomas, I'll come visit you. We'll hang out. I'm just going to keep attacking with Direfully Daredevil so I can block with a snake and then then they don't. Yeah, I guess they are. Oh, wow. I mean, I'll block here, I guess. Sure. I'm not going to ultimate price because if they have like Thunder Maw Hellkite or friggin' Hellrider or something, it's just I'd rather have that in my hand. Because again, going to 12 is fine. Fire blast that. Because I have no cards in hand. <laughs> That's... Oh, man. Well, that does negate two of their draws. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think there's any better time to play that. Next time we can solemn. <sighs> Thank you. Oh, Smokey Loki with a gifted sub to long sleeve pants. Wow. What? Why is that a thing? Let's get a swamp, huh? That's ridiculous. 
That's ridiculous. Do I ski or snowboard? No, I do not. I'm terrible at all those things. I haven't had enough life experience with skiing and snowboard. It was snow to uh, to be good at any sort of snow sports. Snowtivities. Snowtivities, yeah. Oh, see, that's real good. Do we just eternal witness and plow under him again? It's okay. Now I think we question beast, eternal witness, plow under, and then next turn plow him under. But I don't want to give them any free draws. Like, they have nothing right now. Oh, yeah. I remember when we drafted with Rob, and Rob was like, is Plow Under good? I don't know. And then we Plow Under someone three times in the same match, and they're like, Rob's like, oh, it's real good. <laughs> We're just going to keep this in hand in case we draw. Avenger. See, because now they're going to draw land. We're going to go questing beast for four. They're going to go land. We're going to go questing beast for four. And then, like, we're in a good position no matter what they draw. Whereas, like, if we give them a land first, like, it just seems worse. It's kind of a little chilly in here. I love how exasperated Mike sounds when he says, they're just called pants. <laughs> they're just called pants. That's because he was, like, cackling. So my thought about playing the <clears throat> questing beast first. Uh-huh. Is that, like, what are you scared of in the mono-red deck that they can draw when you're at 10 and you have a questing beast and you witness on board? Well, it's not about being scared, though. I just think this gives us better time. Yeah, I'm going to take that because now we can crack back for two, and I think that's probably better for us. Basic plow math. <laughs> oh! Oh, that's also good. I feel like we wait, though. Because I don't want to mill the land that they're going to draw. So, Wait, did they already draw the land? They draw one of them. So next turn, they're also going to draw land. No, we plowed them. They drew a land. Yep. No, now they're right. going to draw one more. So now we just... They're, it's just mountain. And now we have sword, beast, ewit. Guys, make sure you check out mandatraders.com. They have an amazing subscription service and uh, you get 20% off the first three months with any of any subscription with the link. The, red deck? the link and promo code down below, so be sure to check that out. Cool stuff, Inc. every Wednesday. And uh, be sure to follow or subscribe on Twitch. You can also go to patreon.com slash franklaporn for $1 or $2 a month. You can support the channel. So that's a great way to do it. And it looks like we're doing all right against the, the mono red deck here. I'm pretty sure we're just going to equip this sword. And, and, and at least even if we don't... I don't know what one card they could draw when we have removal for like Hellrider, Thunder Maw, Hellkai, things like that. And I think like we can get in for, for eight if we put the sword on here, but I think if we just put it on Questing Beast, it's better because if they draw like a Koth or if they draw like a four damage burn spell, like I'd rather just have Questing Beast alive, so. Also, they could just block, I guess. Oh, they didn't block. Oh, no, they can't, because cause Questing Beast. Good gravy, dude. What the hell? You know, the bonfire, it's not lethal. You can only do it for five. Yeah, the mono red deck doesn't play bonfire a tremendous amount, though. Most decks don't. Card just shouldn't even be in the cube. I agree with that. Like, who really wants that card in the deck? I think, like, the number of gotta moments with Bonfire is just too low. Questing Beast does have a lot of tech. Shut up and take my money! Unforgiven. Mono Green Step preferred with slight splash of any color if necessary. Would first something with Crater Hoof and or Tooth and Nail. Power and lands. Nice. That seems good. I have not actually done a Mono, a mono Green. Dude, thank you so much, man. really appreciate it. I'll write that bad boy down. I'll put it in the queue. I mean, if you get the good mono green deck, I think it is very good. Wow, this is exactly why we wow. why we kept the kept the sword on questing beast. That's hilarious. I mean, conscripts is the worst case, but in that situation, I just kill our own questing beast. If he dies, he dies. Yep. So this is game though, right? Because the mountain goes back to a land. 
they have nothing in the graveyard to to cast they have no fire bolts and we just get to kill their one blocker he did roger the boogly Thank you. Oh, you're thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. I've come to knock on Mike's door. Wow. Well, <clears throat> he will be waiting for you. <laughs> oh, they have ancient grudge, but they don't have a they don't have a green, so I guess that's fine. And then they're still dead, right? They're at eight. They take eight. Well if they yes. Okay, so I guess it doesn't matter. and that's how you trophy once more once more and trophying with a step is value trophying with a step is value that was the rylos 24 opposite step thank you guys so much for watching really appreciate it sign those like and subscribe buttons. let's let's god dang it I'm just going all over the place let's open this treasure chest like you do 10 and eerie eerie <laughs> monsters and a necroplasm, a Mike B card. Is that a Mike B card? Because he's just looking all sloth-like in the back. <laughs> in the back. In the back. That's her. Yeah, all right. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you next time, guys.